Good evening, everybody. I'm Denshin Asenshi, and welcome to Metroid Fusion. Quite possibly the greatest GBA game that has ever been made. And I say that only slightly exaggeratingly. Metroid Fusion is an absolute masterpiece of a storyline. I didn't know it had a demo. I never get this far into the title screen. I did not know there was a demo. This is way late in the game. So is this. <laughs> wow. Okay, so let's get into this. Start. Oh, I guess I don't get a choice between easy or normal mode. I'd been assigned to watch over Biologic's research team. Samus is a girl. What am I doing? So I once again found myself on the surface of SR-388. That's another thing I love about this game too, is the soundtrack. The soundtrack is... Mm. The soundtrack is fire. It was there that I was attacked by a life form I had never encountered before. It was only later that I learned the identity of my attacker. The parasitic organism we now know as X. I know I said attacker before it came up on the screen, but I've played through this game at least 10 to 15 times. At least. So I almost have all the dialogue memorized. Unaware of my condition, I was returning to the station when a disaster struck. Once the X had infested my central nervous system, I lost consciousness and my ship drifted into an asteroid belt. Because that's a thing. That's some pretty fast drifting. Tokyo Drift. No. The ship's emergency systems automatically ejected the escape pod before impact. Biologics vessel recovered it and transported me to Galactic Federation HQ. However, during the journey, the X multiplied within me, corrupting large areas of my power suit. That's a key point there. It then came to light that the organic components of my power suit had become so integrated with my system that it could not be removed while I was unconscious. Large portions of my suit had to be surgically removed, dramatically altering my physical appearance. However, the X in my central nervous system were too embedded to be removed safely. I was given a minimal chance of survival. Then, someone found a cure. They proposed using a Metroid cell to make an anti-X vaccine. It seems that the Federation had managed to preserve a cell culture from the last infant Metroid from SR-388. The serum was prepared and injected without delay. The X parasites were immediately and completely destroyed. I'm sorry if that was super loud. As for me, one life ended, yet I survived, reborn as something different. Pondering this fact, I realize I owe the Metroid hatchling my life twice over. We'll soon be arriving at the BSL research station. I must prepare for docking. The ship's computer has notified me of our approach to the Biologic Space Labs, or BSL, research station. During my surgery, the research team sent the last batch of creatures we captured there, as well as the infected pieces of my power suit. After regaining consciousness, I learned that an unexplained explosion rocked the station. For some reason, this awoke a nameless fear in my heart, and now I am being sent there to investigate. My mission on the BSL station will be overseen by my new ship's computer. If 
Following the commands of this blunt, computerized CO is something I have to bear, as it was a condition of my taking the mission. Or taking the ship. I can't read. For someone who dislikes taking orders, this is the second time I've found myself having to do so. It makes me recall my other CO. Another key point! I like the ship. That's a cool design. Very cool. There's been an explosion in the quarantine bay. The bay currently stores capsules containing recent samples from SR388, as well as parts of your suit infected by the X-Parasites. The cause of the explosion is as yet unclear. Investigate. The quarantine bay is here. Move quickly and quietly. You are still unable to use most of your latent abilities. Don't forget that, Samus. Stop at the navigation room on the way. Uplink from there. Is your objective clear? No! No, it's not clear. S screw you, computer. No, it's clear. Now, go to the quarantine bay. Okay. Just familiarizing myself with the controls again. Come on. What just happened there? Oh my god. <laughs> Navigation room. Oops. Pass it over. The quarantine bay is ahead. Biosigns are confirmed. Be careful. And suddenly it's dark and creepy. Can't quite go that way yet. I don't have my power ball. Oh, come on. Back to the navigation room. This is unfortunate news. The specimens brought back by the field team were infected by... Forget it. By x -Persates. The X can mimic its prey. Any specimen could have hosted it. Before the explosion, a security sensor scanned one. The gelatinous x parasites invade rap and rapidly produce, killing the host creature. They also absorb DNA and use it to mimic the host. You were almost killed by an X infection. Only the Metroid vaccine saved your life. Seems Metroids were the main predators of the X. That's why the vaccine works so quickly and so well. It also changed your cellular makeup. You will never be infected by an X again. In fact, you can now absorb any free-floating X parasites without a host by merely touching them, as you saw. So you to replenish health and restore weapons. You may also restore latent abilities this way, so pursue free X parasites whenever you possibly can. There's some demands. We may keep the X out of the breeding environments. Vital. Detecting massive. Bio. X gathering. Baby chance. Exterminate. 10%. Extremely low, Federation, a clear, get going, level zero. You'll kite. What in the actual hell just happened? The game literally froze for a second. I think I go this way. Mm. <laughs> yeah, 
Yes, my objective is clear. The computer reminds me of a Gruff Federation CEO I served under named Adam Malkovich. He called me Lady on missions. For anyone else, it would have sounded sarcastic, but Adam made it sound dignified. Out of respect, and with some irony, I named the computer after him. And power outage. Yay. Maybe related to the X, I'll work on it. As for you, try to find another way to the target. It's located here. I'm reading huge bio signs, so I hope your missiles work. To reload missiles, you can use a recharge room or absorb a special type of X parasite. You'll see them. Try it out. Is your objective clear? Yes. Missiles are your only hope. Don't, don't hesitate to use them. Find a way to the target. All right, we going. Not like that. Oops. Shot one too many missiles. Come on. Yes. Missile tank acquired! Yay. Oh, forgot to jump. That special red X there that you saw, that refills your health and stuff entirely. Eh, I was trying to be fancy. Energy tank! Yay! And here we go. First boss fight, here we go! Oh. Ah, I didn't jump. Why didn't I jump? You don't actually need the missiles for this for this boss. Well, you do for this. Oh, come on. Yeah, that only takes three. Just like, give me the X. And that recovers my morph ball ability. And we were at a save room. So that was the first boss of Metroid Fusion. 
So I think I'm going to go ahead and call the episode here. So if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.